Okay, in this lesson, we want to uh, doing this project. As you can see, we have a user fracture and linear object to disconnecting and exploding or rotating any effect that you want to design to parameter. And if you render, as you can see, we have a smooth object and explode object here. We use a connect, fracture, and some sitting, important sitting of that, and doing this project. Let's do. Okay, let's begin. Uh, I create a torus here, go into the model mode, don't forget that. Can make it a bit bigger and going and we need more segment to better and more interesting works. And okay, of course <clears throat> we need to make them editable to uh, access all of the, this polygon. And okay, this is our model first create our fracture and let's begin with that deselect go to fracture you can with the fracture as i said before you can access the polygon and effector that you can combine them so this is then green for the green tool you have to make the object child of that and it's done and in the object the mode is important here is explode okay first Go to the effector and we need the effector. We need, for example, the common plane effector. As you can see, as I said before, it's in a parameter and it's in a field you can create a linear. And as you can see, it just bring whole object up. But it does not our job because we need to affect all of the polygons. But if you go to the explode segment, as you can see, it does not change anything because all of the segments, you can turn them all off because all of the segment of this object is connected. As you can see, the fracture ca cannot reach the, these polygons. So we need to disconnect them. For disconnecting all polygon, you can control A and select in a surface mode, in polygon mode. Then right click and we need to uh, use the disconnect command. Don't forget, before clicking disconnect, go to the settings and uh, untick these preserved groups because this object is one group, but it's preserved it in one group. And if OK, boom, as you can see, if you go to, for example, the render mode, as you can see, it's completely deformed the object. We have a solution to solve that, don't worry. But in this situation, as you can see, go to the model mode. Now our fracture is now access to all of the object and we can create this such an interesting effect. But in this case, I need Go to the plane effector and a parameter. Instead of that, scaling. Uniform, negative one. Completely disappear. And that is our purpose. Nice. This is not such a disaffect. But if you render it, as you can see, we have this problem. So you learn another usage of the connect is this. You can use the connect, give the fracture under the connect. And after that, as you can see, we solve that issue. Connect the object that the that effector does not reach them with the field. And you can render it and give a nice objects. Interesting. So in this lesson, you learn another thing of fracture. In a fracture, don't forget to explode segment. If you take it straight, it does not work or any of them. Just explode segment. And before that, you have to actually explode the segment object with a disconnect tool. And here you can use a plane and a linear vector and then connect the other object to a smooth one. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos 
that release.